And for those that have just joined us on the live stream on YouTube at both channels, Bellator, MMA, and Showtime Sports, we welcome you to Chicago here at Wintrust Arena. The prelims continue now as we move to the flyweight division. Scheduled for three five-minute rounds, we introduce the blue corner. At five foot five, weighing in 125.6 pounds, her professional record three and three, fighting out of and representing the country of Turkey, presenting Sabri Shagui. And across the cage, her adversary, fighting out of the red corner, at five foot six, weighing in 126.6 pounds as a professional. She stands with five wins, no defeats, fighting out of San Francisco by way of Van Nuys, California. Introducing the undefeated Carrie Taylor Melendez. And when the bell rings in charge, you referee Blake Grice. Melendez, married to former Strike Force lightweight champion Gilbert Melendez, Scrap Pack Ready? members Jake Shields Ready? and Nate Fight. Diaz just making their presence known at cage side to support Kerry Taylor Melendez taking on Sabri Shukwi, who is looking to bounce back from a submission defeat in her Bellator debut against Denise Kuholtz, and of course, she has celebrated a birthday recently, turned 35 last Monday, and she's already tasting the striking acumen of Melendez. We've seen Gary Melendez before. Her striking is outstanding, but the thing that really has made her special now is she now has a ground game. She has been working on it. She now takes the fight to the ground when she wants does a beautiful job in body positioning and setting up submissions, so she's got the full package. Now, since fighting in Bellator, where she made her professional debut against Kuholtz back in 2019, Shukwi has gone a three and two, coming off a win in March via TKO. Win it gone here in the first. Well, we, again, we've seen Shukwi, and she's got great kickboxing. She will, she'll stand in there, and she will throw, but when Denise Kielholz took her to the ground, she looked almost like a fish out of water and was very upset that Denise didn't stand with her. And it's like, no, it's MMA. Don't get upset, learn. So we'll see if she learns if Carrie ends up taking her to the ground. Check left hook by Melendez. 90 seconds. Gone by in the first, overhand right by Shukui. So we now throwing with bad intentions, single was collar tie, the knees up the middle by Melendez doing damage to Shugui's body. That knee right up the middle definitely dug in and did damage. Shugui felt it, you can see her react to it. Yeah, you can hear Carrie Melendez's husband Gilbert saying she did not like that knee to the body, get back to doing it. There is like El Nino Gilbert there. Melendez. Left foot's in. Good. Forearm knee, left forearm knee. Good. Left forearm knee. Yes, again. Stay here, Carrie. You're doing good. Again. Again. Keep her here. Great work. Left forearm. Right forearm. Right elbow, left elbow. Good. Elbow knee. Elbow knee. Take your time. Wrap her head. Good. Good. Good, again, keep her here, Kerry. Breathe, left elbow again. Over and over, babe. Shoulder bump, right shoulder bump, left elbow. Shoulder bump, good, again. Foot stomp, two. Good, yes, yes. Almost I can do this all night. I, I can do this all night. Like you can game. continue, and I'm just going to sit and enjoy again. this commentary from El Nino, good, good. of course, Stop Melendez, good. and our Josh Thompson. Responsible for one of the best trilogies I've ever witnessed in MMA during the Strike Force days here good work, good work. on a Showtime, and now his wife good, Melendez good, doing good. a good job of controlling Shogwe. Sorry for interrupting you, Mr. Melendez. <laughs> Take your time, elbow knee. Good, grab him. Hey, lock your hands, Gary. Lock your hands. Lock your hands. Take her down. Lock your hands. Take her down. Good, good. Stay, keep her there. 
Dudley looking to work. turn the tables. They jockey for Elbow position, and Melendez happy over with what he has over. seen thus far. Over and over, shoulder bump. Should we really over. have a hard time, hard time with the head positioning? Nice, carry. good. Good. Shoulder Karen bump. Melendez is just dominating the head shoulder positioning, shoulder which is making Shogui look in directions that makes One her minute. weak and opens Elbow. her up for the knees. <laughs> Good to punch combination from Shogui to create distance. A minute left here in the opening round. Good slip by Melendez. Able to see. Here's another kick. Right, one, two, oh, counter right, landed for Melendez. Shogui, bloody. 30 seconds left in the round, and again, a good job of Melendez using angles to escape the attack of a Shugui. And meanwhile, Melendez able to continue landing that bludgeoning jab. The jab is working. She's doing a beautiful job of countering. When Shugui comes in, she's looking for what she's throwing and countering well. And she's not, Shugui is not setting up, throwing everything with bad intentions, which of course is taxing the gas tank as well. Final seconds of uh, the opening round. As far as facially, the nose looks like it might be broken. Low kick by Melendez to the lead leg of Shogui. Lead high kick. Shogui again, missing with the one, two. Good counter right hand upstairs by Melendez. He's landed big advantage for Melendez. When you got 100% there, it's pretty good. Again, the check hook lands for Melendez. that Melinda's biggest strengths her speed and her patience. That, you know, it's a great assessment because one of the things about Carrie Melendez is she is patient. She takes her time. She waits for you to make mistakes and she tries to take you back. Oh, right there. There's Shockwave's best punch of the fight that popped. Melendez head back momentarily. Now Shockwave against the fence. Melendez with the grip. The over under. See, and in those situations when she's using that cage and grabbing it, you're seeing Blake Rice talk to her, but she grabbed and held that position to pull Carrie into her. It's time to just say, no, you lose the position and put him back to the center. Finally, away from the cage, Melendez. Front headlock. She has two submission wins on her record. Uh, she's starting to work that guillotine. Looking for her first high guillotine choke win. She's got two rear naked chokes, and there's the tap! And Carrie Taylor Melendez! Ladies and gentlemen, with the guillotine in tight, the tap comes officially two minutes, six seconds into round number two. The number of by submission still undefeated Carrie Taylor! Melendez!